Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Aquarians, this is the 0202 Eden reading for you guys. So I want to thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. 0202, this is the time when you're going to be healing yourself, you guys. And this is the healing reading. So Aquarians, what is coming up for you? For 0202, what is coming up for the Aquarians? For 0202, let's see what's coming up for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. For 0202, what it is that you will be affected by, okay? What is it you Aquarians will be affected by? Um, what I'm getting is a lot of um, energies, positive energies that is going to be coming up, okay? So um, what is transpired is that we are dealing with the energies, the positive alignment of energies. And what is transpiring is that you guys, uh, there is just so much that is happening to you. Okay. So I'm, I'm going to be using, I tell you, my God, in angels, they're like, all righty, I'm doing it. Here I am. All right. Let's see what's coming out. Okay. They wanted me to use this light a card and this is what is coming out so let's see what is going to be affecting you guys what is going to be affecting you it is the mirror the mirror who or what is triggering you okay so you parents are going to be thinking who or what is triggering me at this time what is happening to me what is transpiring with me so it is an healing time so you Aquarian and the energy of a mirror is going to be coming out and you Aquarians are going to be asking yourself, who am I? What it is that is triggering me? What it is that I need to be? Where is it that I need to be in my life? What is it that I need to be doing? Changing myself and doing something better. Okay. What are the obstacles that is going to be coming up for the Aquarians is in it. You need to go within. Okay, the obstacles is that you're not going within and you need to go within. So whatever is transpiring you Aquarian, what is transpiring here, the obstacles that you are going to be having is that you need to go within and connect with yourself. The devotion of uh, um, toning in the portals of the heart. So you need to open the portals of your heart. Okay, and this is going to be good. What you need to learn, Aquarians, you need to learn something about past life. Your guidance is the divine guidance, okay? You need to learn about the divine guidance, your past life, Akasha, the Akashic Records. So some of you could be moving towards connecting to find out something about past life, the Akashic, the Akashic Records, okay? So, um, ooh, and I understand um what is happening so um some of you really need to align yourself and go find out something about the akashic record something about your past something about what is connecting this moment of time with your past life okay your guidance is divinely guided so um if you are working with the akashic records or that sort of a thing um you're going to be divinely guided guided at this time okay what you need to relinquish aligning your life what you need to relinquish is getting back getting back on your life purpose getting back finding out who you who you are relinquish the things that no longer serve you connecting in a higher spirit connecting in a higher way connecting it in a positive way re um doing who you are changing your program and deprogramming yourself and as you let go of this because this is something that you need to let go okay this is what you need to relinquish that no longer serves you okay and align yourself you need to um, um the false mask you need to remove that fall mask and align yourself okay and make that changes because as you make the changes you're going to be realizing how important it is to make that changes in your life because you need to relinquish whatever it is you need to relinquish out of your life in order for positive alignment of energies to come in okay very very beautiful okay so who will help you um, 
there are different ways people will help you um how will you be helped by a transformation things are going to be changing at a cellular level deep healing is going to be coming in for you Aquarian so I see when they said um, transformation transformation is when your spirit guides your angels yourself you're aligning with yourself you're understanding yourself and you're going within to heal a situation that needs to be ill you're going to be ill in this situation removing the situation you're going to be aligning with the right and positive energy vibration that is going to be coming up so the healing is going to be coming in from your mighty I am present self a transformation is going to be here things are going to be changing at a cellular level so your DNA could be changing and you could be receiving a deep healing at this time moving forward what is going to be coming up or the next step for you Aquarian how are you going to be balance this out the Palladians are going to be coming in and helping you guys out okay um double mission channeling and uplifting humanity so the palladians energies are coming in to help you so if you're an aquarian and you're in a, a palladian i see this energy is going to be coming up to help you this is going to be wonderful because it's going to be moving you forward in a very very positive alignment of energy and this is going to be absolutely absolutely fabulous because this energy is moving you forward okay so the obstacle of you going in the inner temple, the divinity, the tuning in to the portal of your heart, what is going to acclaim you is that the Palladian energy is going to be coming in and it's going to be a double mission that is going to be helping you to challenge and uplift up yourself and uplift humanity so call upon the palladians you aquarians in the sun because they're going to be coming in and helping you and the last energy that is here is the lemuria and it says create heaven and hurt it is happening so you guys are going to be learning to create heaven and hurt because it's going to be happening for you whether or not you want this to happen um, by using the Lemurian energy it's going to be helping you to create heaven and hurt this is a positive alignment of energy because these beams and universal angels are going to be coming in and is protecting you on your journey to receive the healing on this day of what it is that you need to change in your life so very beautiful energies um for you aquarians so i can't say um, um any um negative energies anything that is going to be transpiring and coming up it is a positive it is about you going back to lifetime to find out certain in, in information transformation is going to be a the mirror is the center for you guys so i guess you guys are going to be looking in the mirror you're going to be releasing whatever that don't align with your life purpose you're going to be relinquishing that and you are going to be going back to the akashic records some of you could be doing akashic records reading to find out about your past life but this is all about a transformation it's all about you seeing yourself in the mirror it's all about in the inner temple that is within you okay so let's see the energy of the inner temple where who you're going to be meeting with the energy of the inner temple Ooh, ah this is going to be good this is going to be absolutely good um you are going to be um as you go within for this inner healing for this inner temple your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true aquarians go get it because your wishes and dreams are definitely going to be coming true so it's as if it's a renewal by you devoting yourself tuning in to the portals of your heart your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true the eye princess is here and she is um, grateful she's coming in because the eye princess um, the Palladians are going to be connected with the eye princess that is going to be bringing you light in this world and this is going to be very very positive so the en energy of a double mission challenging and uplifting humanity where the energy of the eye princess is going to be coming in and aligning the energies around you so this is beautiful your wishes and dreams are going to be in alignment um 
the energy of the three of cups is in reverse because some of you need to create the heaven on earth and it's as if you you are not yet creating the heaven on earth so this energy um that is aligning you is not really um creating because you need to create the heaven and hurt whenever you create heaven and hurt then you will be able to successfully um you know happy and celebrating but um this is in the future so it's going to be in the next uh, three months to nine months um three 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 yeah oh four mm -hmm. yeah so uh, when you come on to the month of uh, October, November, December, that's when you're going to be creating your heaven on earth. So this is a, a wonderful alignment of energy. Um, very positive, very purified, very good. Let's see what is the message that is coming in um, from the source. I always give you a good night kiss. So this is coming up for people out there who have lost their parents um, or a relative sister or brother or a child this is a message for you that is coming up and they are saying to you that they always give you a good night kiss so whatever is happening and transpiring um, they are coming up to let you know they always give you a good night kiss okay so this is wonderful this is from the spirit world now we're going to be looking at the magical alignment of energies empowerment is here um, for you Aquarians it's all about empowering yourself you're more powerful than you realize it is safe for you to be powerful so whatever the issue the situation is this healing is about empowerment whatever is transpired it's all about empowering yourself so this healing reading is about you Aquarians empowering yourself in a very wonderful powerful alignment of energy and this is going to be God then as we move forward we see the energy of the dragon flies transformation magic and illumination transformation magic and illumination so this healing period is going to be very wonderful because it's going to be where the fire dragons comes up and illuminating you in very wonderful positive energies and this is going to be very fantastic because the fire dragons transform negative forces negative energy negativity and the magical energies are going to be coming in and the illumination is going to be removed so this is another positive alignment of energy that is coming up for you guys and this is really 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 um powerful it's absolutely powerful so aquarians let's look at your signs okay this is a card so we're going to be reading the bottom and the top and this is um your house what else you're going to be working with you aquarians are going to be working with the fourth else okay and then we're going to be looking at the planetary aspect that is going to be affecting you guys and it is venus venus is going to be affecting you guys okay so in order for me um, to read this I have to put them flat because they have um, different uh, messages that is coming up so for some of you what they're saying is that um, a genius uh, a genuine to experiment with as you did in the past and cherish so it's all about love the planet of Venus is all about love and in the upright position and in the position that is 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 that some of you genuinely is going to be experiencing as if you did this in a past lifetime and you're going to be cherishing the lessons that is coming out so this is wonderful for some of you um um m for some of you um the discovery of your own home base or your family you're going to be enjoying that okay so some of you are going to be discovering your own base okay and your family you're going to be discovering these people these situation in your life and you're going to be happy and you're going to be enjoying this and this is going to be good resulting from and for the p people resulting from um the um the century of what it is you want to do 
do what makes you feel secure okay and cherish heart and beauty or the ways in the world so this is very good and you know not everyone can work with these cards <laughs> someone asked me oh my god you're so funny you work so smoothly with these cards it is um these cards um it gives three alignment of energies and when i'm working with people because this is a fourth house and it's about family so what you realize that um some of you are going to be having like cherishing the past like your parents like you know um someone who passed away you know that sort of a thing and some of you your own base you're going to be enjoying your own base um much easier uh now and some of you do what makes you feel secure okay and um you know charm heart and beauty or the ways uh, um to you know the result that is going to be coming up for you guys it's just going to be um very beautiful so it's all about family it's all about the fourth house you aquarians and it's all about family in this period however it is helping you however it is coming up for you take the lessons that is going to be given you in the spirit of healing understanding what this um february 020220 is all about and um remember if you want the extended reading use the link below and pick up your extended reading ladies and gentlemen i want to say thank you for being here namaste until next time